And what we do here is 1950s, 1960s industrial printing. Over the last few years, a lot of people have uh, discovered it and it, it has become very, very popular. Our process is, is an ideal way to recreate something that was, that was done more than 50 years ago. We were asked to reproduce the original sleeve as close as possible to the original means of production. Some parts of it we have reset the type in exactly the same typeface, the same sizes, uh, and we've made sure that the lines end in the same place and all the spacing is the same. And that's the bulk of the, the text on the back of the sleeves. There's other parts where we didn't have the right type. There's um, a rope on a grey panel on the front of volume one, for example. Originally, it would have been drawn by an artist and photographed. Um, our one was done from scans of the, of the original sleeve. There was a lot of discussion about getting the colour right, getting the blue right, getting the image looking right. It's been quite a long process. The machine that the sleeves are printed on is called a Heidelberg cylinder press. Also, we do proofing as part of the process. That's done on a separate proofing press. The state of the machine is important and how, how it's looked after. My machines are cleaned and oiled and, and the rollers are kept in good condition. You have to look after what you've got. The type was set and cast on a monotype machine. You're putting individual pieces of metal together and you're putting them in the right order so that it makes words. It's an exciting challenge to do something that was done more than 50 years ago and get it, and get it the same. It was very exciting when we did the first machine proof and saw the thing printed. It looks like a record speed from the 1950s. It's, it's, it's great. If it was a pastiche, it wouldn't be true to the original. What we're printing is as true to the original as it can be given the time has moved on. Had that been printed with a um, 21st century process, it would have looked good, but it wouldn't have been the same. The thing that we've made, you can look at it and it's got something different. Most people won't know what it is. A lot of people probably won't see it, but for those who care and for, for those who know, it's, it's there.